Uh, I'm Michael, and this is Thompson and Lucy. Thompson and Lucy, and today we're going to show you guys how to know if a piece is heisey. A lot of people ask, uh, how do you know it's heisey, or where is it marked, or um, how how would you find the mark? And so today uh, we pulled out some fun pieces where the diamond H is uh, hidden in a clever spot, and we thought we'd share some of those with you. So uh, I'm going to let the kids here show you where these different pieces are marked. So where, what is the, the Heisey mark? What does it look like? Um, a diamond with um, a H inside. A diamond with it an H inside. Heisey. Because Heisey. Yeah. So normally uh, people think it would be marked on the bottom like uh, most glass companies did or like Heisey did in a lot of cases and they put the diamond H right there flat and center on the bottom. You can't really miss it. Um, but that's not always the case. A lot of times they hid the mark. Um, I've heard rumors where uh, in the 30s, uh, one of the Heisey wives didn't like the mark being dead bottom center on plates and things, kind of staring at you while you were eating. Um, and so they kind of got creative and, and hid the mark. So uh, we thought we'd share some of those with you. So um, this is a Victorian plate. And it's marked in a really fun spot. Thompson, do you remember uh, where it is? It's not marked in the bottom center. Daddy, why do we have the um, bag um, here on the glass? And some looks like have, some have come off. Right? Some of those come off, yep. So yeah. this one is marked really cleverly uh -huh. here on the bottom of one of the little squares of the Victorian pattern. So um, not marked bottom center, but marked there in one of the little panels. So kind of clever. Uh, Lucy, what about one of yours? Where is this? You mentioned this one. Where is it marked? Do you remember? Mm -hmm. See, everybody looks at the bottom. It's not on the bottom. I'm Dad. Yeah. It's on the handle. It's on the handle. I didn't know that. I, so, I just saw that. Right here on the bottom just, of the handle, the bottom of the lightning bolt handle, there is a... Thank you. There is a small little diamond H down there. So, very cleverly marked. Uh, hidden there again. Lucy, can you go okay, put that back? All right, Thompson, where, uh, what piece you want to pick next? Um, maybe this one. This one, okay. So this is a Charter Oak um, Comport in Moongleam. And where is it marked? Is it on the bottom? No, no Dad. Is it Daddy, in the top center here? Silly. No. No? Where is it? This is part of the fun of Heisey is looking for the Diamond H or being out in an antique mm -hmm. store or thrift right shop and uh, finding that mark. So this one is right above the acorn here on the top of the stem. You can see it there, hidden there in the top. You can also see it from the uh, top side kind of looking down. All right, now one of Lucy's. Which one are you going to pick next? That one? Okay, another cruet. This is the plantation cruet. Where is that one marked, Lucy? This one's kind of faint. Is it marked on the handle again? No. Get down, get down. Well, it isn't that one. So this one's kind of neat because it has a paper label. Uh, so it has the Diamond H. Thank you, Lucy. It has the Diamond H label or logo on the label there, but it also is marked with the Diamond H very faintly up here at the top of the neck of the cruet. Uh, it's pretty faint, I'm not even sure if it'll pick it up here on the <laughs> computer, but marked up here on the top of the neck. So, Dad. So, uh, Thompson, your next turn, which one do you want to show next? Hmm. This is a pretty tricky one. Well, that's a pretty tricky one. So this yeah. is a little cordial glass in the Jamestown pattern. And uh, is it marked on the bottom again? No. Nope. Even though it's... <clears throat> It's flat. Lucy, get up here. Yeah, can't put his finger flat. Mine too. Yours too. Find it yet? No. Okay, let me show them. So this one's marked really, really cutely here on the stem right there. Oh, I, I actually remembered about that. So a very tiny little diamond H there on the top of the stem. She saw it. Did you see that, everybody? So very hard to see there, but right here at the very top, 
right above my fingernail is the diamond H. Marked very boldly for such a small little stem. All right, Lucy, which one are you going to do next? Um, this one. That one? Okay. This is the Empress pattern. This is the Empress mint dish in Sahara. It's what? I don't know. It's oh, okay. Google. Okay, so where's this one marked? You remember? Uh, what are we looking for again? It's not on a the diamonds with the H. Diamonds inside. with H's inside of them, okay? And where is it marked, Lucy? The, the, kind of small. On the back of the foot. Good job. They, so they on a lot of the Empress pattern, when they have these dolphin feet on them, a lot of times they put the mark on the back of the foot. So this is the back side here. See if I can get the light to reflect just right. There you go. There's the diamond H oh, I see that. on the back of the foot. Let's so see, on the back of the foot. So pretty cool. Now That's I'm one that a lot of people miss. Okay, Thompson's gonna go next. This is the tricorn candlestick in flamingo. Where is it marked? A lot of people probably don't even know these are marked. This is a really, really hidden one. Let me see. Come back up. Not on the bottom. It's not under there. It's in one of the corner crevices of the tricorn design. So let me show them here. So, Lucy, get back over here. Okay. Right there, buddy. Oh, nice. Yeah. Okay, so right above the acorn, here in the little tricorner of that shape, it's kind of faint, but it is there. A um, little tall, skinny little diamond H hidden in there. I'm finished. You're finished with yours? Lucy, do you have any left? Yes, you do. Yeah, this one here. So this is, bring it up here. Okay. So, Lucy! Okay, so this is a plantation uh, sherbet. It's a blown, blown bowl with a pressed stem. And the diamond H is actually on one of the little leaves of the little pineapple here. So he saw it. Pretty Lucy. marked here um, on top of the leaf, right there. You can see it. So, hidden right in the design of the pineapple leaf, it's marked. All right, guys, what do you have to share with these people? Anything else? No, no, do you guys like Heisey Glass? Wait, wait, I have five. Well, this one was mine. Okay, so we all have four except for me. Okay. You gonna want to tell them, tell them anything about Heisey Glass? No. Uh, Heisey can break. Heisey can break. Sure. We've learned that. <laughs> um, it's a pretty cool glass. It's pretty fun to look for the Diamond H. Gives us something to look for while when we find the glass. Um, and a neat little neat little bit of history there. So, all right. Anything else? Uh, no. Nope. All right. Thanks, guys.